As a prescription medical device, only a physician can prescribe the settings used for treatment. However, for comfort and treatment tolerance, adjustments for an individual within the prescribed range should be considered. This video will review appropriate SmartVest settings and titration methods. In manual mode, start the titration process at 6 Hz and 10% pressure. Low settings helps a patient acclimate to their new therapy. Notice the slow inflation of the garment and that it could take up to one minute for the garment to fully inflate with air. Slowly increase hertz to find a comfortable frequency for the patient while listening for a bounce in the patient's voice. Keep in mind, young, elderly, frail, and medically complex patients may not be able to tolerate a hertz setting higher than eight or 10. To check for tolerability of hertz, ask questions such as, do you feel dizzy? Does this level of speed cause feelings of nervousness? Does this level of speed make it challenging to breathe easily? Make note of the patient's floor and ceiling hertz levels. In this example, the appropriate hertz range for this patient is eight to 12 hertz. Once appropriate hertz levels have been identified, you will titrate the pressure setting. Starting at the patient's identified low hertz level, slowly increase the pressure setting in increments of 5% pressure while listening for a bounce in the patient's voice. Through communication with the patient, identify the appropriate pressure setting range at a specific hertz level. To check for tolerability, ask questions such as, how easy is it to take a deep breath? Are there any areas of discomfort on your chest wall? Does this pressure setting cause you to feel any chest tightness? Does this pressure setting cause you to feel any shortness of breath? Make note of the tolerable pressure settings for the Hertz level, repeating the process for other Hertz levels. Keep in mind, patients may not be able to tolerate higher pressure settings and higher hertz levels, but may be able to tolerate inverse hertz and pressure settings. These settings are an example of what an elderly patient with COPD and bronchiectasis may be able to tolerate. 